In this Canva tutorial, let's take a look at how you can remove blemishes and maybe touch up someone's photo. So we have a case here where maybe this photo shoot was just after someone got stitches and they couldn't control that, but they want that removed because obviously it's going to eventually heal. So here we can click on the photo itself and then go up to edit photo and use the pretty awesome magic eraser option. Now this is a Canva Pro feature, so you can try Canva Pro for 30 days. I pay for Canva Pro, I would recommend uh, trying it out at least. So you can adjust the brush size and then paint over the area that you want to basically erase in a very magical way. That's called the magic eraser. So we paint over this area that has all of this sort of uh, stitching through here, make sure we get it all covered up, and then we let Canva do its magic. So basically it'll read the image, look at what's around it, and fill in uh, based on you know what you're telling it you want to get rid of. So there you go. Just like that, we removed it. And we could keep you know making little minor adjustments here depending on how much you want to kind of tweak the different area that we're actually removing. So you can see how quickly and how smoothly that got rid of the stitches uh, you know, just below his eye here. If there's other areas that you want to remove, you know, we can zoom in with the scroll wheel on our mouse and maybe just touch up some different areas just by clicking on them. You know, it's, it's very similar to Spot Healing Brush if you're used to that in other design software. However, it does use AI to kind of figure out you know, what, what could this person mean they want to get rid of? Maybe I want to touch up some of these areas here. So I'm just using this magic eraser tool to touch up the face um, of, of the subject here. And it's actually really easy to use. I mean, you honestly don't even really need to get into it too much uh, or edit, you know, what you're doing. There aren't a whole lot of tools except for the brush size. So if you find the brush size too large, too small, if you find that it leaves maybe like a circle, that you can, you know, tell is noticeable there, then you can actually, you know, come back in and, and just kind of readjust and re-edit the different little spots that you find or the different artifacts that are left over. But I mean, you can see that as I move around this face here, I'm able to kind of remove a lot of things. And I mean, that before and after is going to look much better, just removing some of the blemishes and touching up, uh, you know, the subject's photo here. Now we just hit the back arrow to exit out of that, and there you go. We've completely removed all of the stitching there uh, using the magic eraser tool here in Canva.